absolutely fantastic day today. Uh, we're risk it's the first leg of the trip, so we've come from Wick and we're just coming into Lerwick now, about 120 miles, and it's just been a dream trip. Lovely sunshine, lovely weather. Uh, this last piece, we had a really big swell, which was great to see the boat running on it. And uh, we stopped in Fair Isle for lunch, which is a stunning place. The National Trust now run it. Uh, just prior to that, though, we went in, uh, we found this great big cave running through a headland. So we put our Vortex HBX suits on and swam through. It's just it's beautiful. So good morning, Norway. We've arrived in, uh, God knows where we are, Malloy. It took us 10 hours. We're very tired. Everyone else has gone to bed. Uh, and I'm about to do the same. The journey was excellent, um, but definitely uh, we need a long day's sleep. So off to refuel in Christiansund and then on to, where are we going? Brovik. Brovik. So we're gonna stop for lunch on a little strip of land in the rain. So we've come to lunch and uh, as is the way I'm learning, you have to get in the water to get out the water. Uh, the guys are pulling the boats up as far as they can and then they'll anchor them. Um, I'm going to get to the beach and find a good spot before, before everyone else gets there because it's such a nice day. I'm sure this beach is going to be very busy very quickly. That being said, it is absolutely beautiful here, even in the rain. tombstoning in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> this is Ed and Pete celebrating Finishing the Gore-Tex Arctic Challenge! That was long, but perfectly good. And I now love Norway, and I now love ribs. Oh, the Gore-Tex Arctic Challenge has just been fantastic. We've proven that these little boats can go from Scotland to Norway, and of course above the Arctic Circle. Um, we've shown that a complete novice can take something like this on and with proper coaching can grow and develop within it and of course enjoy it. We have had a harder days but we've also had good days. Noi is fabulous and I guess the message from all of this is get off your armchair, get out there and go for it. <laughs>